Hi guys, I just wanted to take a few moments to show you how to work a little bit within Emerge and then also how to open a project file which are the files that you will use to submit your homework to your instructor. And so at this point if you're logged into Emerge just like me you have a listing here of concepts, issues, and skills. I'm gonna click skills and then Notice how my Windows 7 uh, offering is open, but if yours isn't, just click the triangle and see how the triangle, when I click it, exposes its two sub-items. Each of these are part of our assignments for week one in CIS 120. So I'm going to click Navigating, and then across the top of the screen, I have the project link. And of course, the project link represents a link to my homework assignment. So I'm going to click it which opens Word 2010. Now, when you're looking at the sheet, this represents part of your homework, and this is the homework assignment that's associated with Windows 7, Section 1.1, entitled Navigating. And what you should do is walk through each of these steps and then fill in answers when you're asked to do so. I'm just going to scroll through the whole document so you can see it in its entirety. So there are quite a few steps here. I'll scroll back up to the top and looking at the first item it says turn on your computer to launch Windows 7. Well, I've already done that and I hope you have too, especially since you're logged into YouTube. Now on step two it says click the start button to open the all programs menu. What two programs are listed at the top of the programs list? And so on your keyboard you click the Windows key and that will be the key, approximately two keys to the left of your spacebar. It looks like a Microsoft Windows icon. If you click that, it'll automatically open um, your start menu and then you can click all programs from there. I'm not going to do that because I'm assuming you know how to uh, perform that little task already. And I'm just going to type something in. My two programs were program one and program two. And then that's it. I could just walk through the rest of these until I get to the end. I answer all of the questions and just type them right after the question is posed on the line. And at the very end, if I'm asked to take a screenshot, I'll just click, create a couple of blank lines by pressing enter, and then I'll open the Windows Snipping tool and I can take a screenshot of whatever I like. I took one of Angel previously really all you have to do is click new and then with your mouse click with your left mouse button and hold over an area that you want to make a copy of and then let go once the copy is made now the icon here within the snipping tool allows you to place uh, the picture that you just took in the clipboard but it's already there we don't have to do that so now if I just click and I can now right click exactly where I was and can paste my image in there and notice that this is an image that's now part of the document and you can do that with any of the other items here I have um, for example the emerge page and I'm just gonna press my alt tab key to go back to the snipping tool take a new snip and let's say that I wanted to include this little section here in my word document assuming that was the instruction now I'll alt tab back over to the word document and I could get rid of the previous screenshot that I captured and I could right click and then paste it or else press control V to paste that image within my document. Lastly I want to save the document to my desktop or to a folder that contains all of my homework and then this will be one of the documents that I submit to my instructor, to my instructor which represents my homework.